So in this video, I kind of wanted to highlight the importance of Mexican sunflower in a subtropical agroforestry system. Um, pretty obvious to many agroforesters, but it's always nice to give a shout out to Tithonia diversifolia. Just look at how good of a, good of a job it's doing. Um, kind of reclaiming the system after that big freeze a few months ago. If you remember, this was just bare brown the entire entirety of February, March, I forget when exactly. Um, but you can see, I'm amazed at how fast these things grow and how much of a microclimate and shade. Look at those little strips of shade. It's like a tunnel of Tithonia in here. Um, and it's provided me with so many benefits. You know, uh, one shade really helps cool things down, keep the soil temperature down um, during these hot, dry months. Um, moisture retention is way higher right now and plants look a lot happier than they would if, if there was no microclimate. Number two, um, it provides a nice little uh, shelter for little bir for birds and rabbits. Unfortunately, the rabbits have been decimating my sweet potatoes, but it's okay, there's more. And you can see that there's been rabbit activity, just life activity. There's a little burrow there. Pretty cool. Um, but the Mexican sunflower is really holding down the fort during this dry spell. Um, so all of this, once it starts raining, will be chopped and dropped and I'll maybe make a video so you can see you guys can see how much material actually is going to be brought down to the ground once the rain starts so not only is it helping establish a microclimate as fast as possible the Mexican sunflower is also going to provide me with tons of tons of biomass for feeding and protecting my little seeds and seedlings once I start planting out in the rainy season. So all this will come down, open up tons of light, and provide tons of biomass for the system. So once again, Mexican sunflower is an indispensable plant. For subtropical agroforestry systems, you just gotta learn how to, or be willing to maintain it and make it work in your favor. You can see just how big they are. A lot of them are overhead height. providing nothing but positive things for the system.